All right, good after evening, as Katina would say. Here is a look at the radar tonight, and it shows no precipitation. We go down to the Gulf. There's a disturbance here. Now, it's really far down, but it is in the Gulf right here that I've circled, uh, and it's going to be moving north in the coming days and perhaps developing into a tropical storm. We need to watch it carefully as um, Mid-South impacts are possible, but it is too early to tell you for sure exactly how it's going to play out. But we will be tracking that very carefully and close in the coming days. And if you're traveling the Gulf Coast anywhere, you should too. 89, the number right now in Memphis, big picture shows not a lot working for us. It is quiet. Uh, there is activity along the Gulf Coast. Again, that is an area that we'll be watching uh, heavily and closely in the coming days with that threat for a tropical system uh, that could develop and either way is going to uh, pose an impact on coastal weather uh, along the Gulf this week. So if you're traveling, you need to think about that and certainly follow the storm carefully and closely. I promise you we will. A nice night out there tonight, 67, the overnight low in Memphis and overnight lows across North Mississippi. Not bad at all for this time of the year. Low 60s everywhere for all of you guys tonight in North Mississippi, 63 in Brownsville. West Tennessee will also have very pleasant numbers, uh, especially with overnight lows in the 70s coming up again. Uh, let's enjoy these 60s because a lot of times in June, you don't get these very often, especially when you're talking about low 60s flirting with the upper 50s. Now, this is the air quality alert. Uh, this was issued not long ago for tomorrow. If you suffer from respiratory uh, disease or any kind of asthma or issues like that, you need to exercise caution and, and try to limit your time outdoors uh, because this is unhealthy air uh, for sensitive groups. That's for Crittenden County, uh, Shelby County, and DeSoto County. Again, air quality alert in effect for tomorrow. That is Wednesday uh, again. So we'll be watching that threat carefully. There's the Gulf Coast once again. I know I keep talking about it, uh, but it is important not only if you're traveling but also for our weather as a matter of fact we could see impacts as early as sunday a lot of uncertainty though here folks uh and some rain chances next week too we are back after this short break